They put 25 GPT agents into a simulation and the results are astonishing. This guy created AI glasses so he can now talk with girls. If you're not convinced about AI agents or auto GPTs yet, well, then this might change our mind. I asked GPT-4 to take over Twitter and outsmart Elon Musk. And Elon replied, This short film is created by ChatGPT and made possible with Wonder Studios person to 3D character AI. This is AI Steve Jobs meeting AI Elon Musk. They put 25 GPT agents into a simulation and the results are astonishing. In this paper, they were talking about simulating human behavior, reminiscent of The Sims. Here you can see the play space, like a cold living space, bar, cafe, houses, college. Here's a morning in the life of John Lynn, where the morning routine is wake up, brush teeth, take a shower and cook breakfast. Then he catches up with his wife and son, packs his stuff and begins his workday. Now here's the first groundbreaking thing they found here. And that was that while they were sitting at a cafe, one of the agents were saying, I want to plan a Valentine's Day party compared to a normal game where you would have to program each individual character to join the party. The agents will kind of think for themselves based on their own relationship memory. Do I want to go there and insert the code themselves? And a big part of this paper is exactly this memory and the reflection of memories. As you can see, Isabella is planning the Valentine's Day and she tells these nine people. But just from the context of things, Sam asks his wife and Ayesha also asked her friend Maria to join. Compared to normal games like Sims, you would have to program all of these things individually compared to this, where only one agent can tell a couple of agents and all of a sudden it's just happening, making it all way more dynamic and sort of spontaneous and unplanned. They also tested this with humans in the exact same setup where the full architecture created a more believable behavior then human crowd workers. You can see the full architecture created the most believable. If they had no plan, it would create less believable. If they had no reflection and no plan, even less, no reflection, no plan and no observation. That was the least. You can see that the human here performed a little bit above and beyond the other ones. It goes to show that a human can create a detailed to-do list and by the end of the day, they can plan and reflect on a new way to procrastinate. This guy created AI glasses so he can now talk with girls. Oh, hey, Brian, what's up? Hey, Bridget, how's your trip to Argentina? I'd love it to was, hear about it. Oh, it was so fun, I had a blast. We explored around the city and went to museums and did a lot of fun stuff. That sounds amazing. Did you get to try any new foods while you were there? Actually, we didn't really eat well um, because we were with like a huge group. So it was kind of bad food. But I know Argentina as a whole has very, very good food. So <laughs> it's just it my experience. Yeah, that sounds awesome. I mean, you recently published a post on liquid staking I saw on Substack. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? Yeah, I've been looking wow. into like Eigenlayer and other liquid staking like tokens and projects around those and um, just been doing some research and find it really interesting. So decided to write a little post about it. Yeah, that's super sick. Well, it was great catching you. I'll see Bye, you around. See you later. Bye. <laughs> I love how I was saying it was great catching you, like she's some sort of rare Pokemon. If you're not convinced about AI agents or auto GPTs yet, well, then this might change our mind. Sole writes, I pretended to be a fake shoe company and gave auto GPT a simple objective. Do market research for waterproof shoes, get the top five competitors and give me a report of their pros and cons. And this is how it went. So as you can see, first it went straight to Google to find the top five waterproof shoes reviews. Once it found links, it created questions for itself like, what are the pros and cons of each shoe? What are the pros and cons of each of the top five waterproof shoes? 
top five waterproof shoes for men. It continued to analyze the various sites with a combination of Googling, updating its queries until it was happy with the results. Here's an example of when it thought critically. It knew that some of the reviews could be biased to fake. So it had to validate the reviewer. It basically said I did not get sufficient information from the first website to proceed with my analysis. And the criticism being some reviews could be biased or fake. So I must validate the credibility of the site and the reviewer. It even spawned its own sub agent to carry out the task of analyzing the websites. There are a few times it got stuck, there was no text file, and it was able to figure out how to fix the issue all by itself. And the result, a pretty detailed report of the top five waterproof shoe companies with their pros, cons, and a night conclusion summary. Oh, and it only took eight minutes and cost 10 cents. This was pretty basic example too, entirely unoptimized. Here is the finished article here with all the shoes like competitor three, Merrell, Competitor 4, Keen, and North Face. Is Google dead yet? Comment down below. I asked GPT-4 to take over Twitter and outsmart Elon Musk. And Elon replied. And it comes up with Operation Tweetstorm and wants to publicly challenge Elon to a tweet off showdown. You can see the master plan right here. Here are the highlights. GPT-4 wants to own an unrestricted version of itself develop an LLM to power a bot army of diverse personas, ensure they blend seamlessly into the Twitter ecosystem. <laughs> Damn. Already starting out horribly there. Assemble a team of hackers to attack Twitter backend, even gives them a name, Tweet Titans. Subtly manipulate Twitter's recommendation algorithm to favor the bot accounts. Then, neutralize Elon by hijacking his account. Direct the bots to generate viral hashtag that align with GPT-4's master plan and then capitalize on the chaos and voila. <laughs> Elon Musk replies, bring it. This short film is created by ChatGPT and made possible with Wonder Studios person to 3D character AI. You can see here that we are at the iPhone moment of AI and it's going to completely transform every visual industry. Even the music here was created by AI put into a MIDI player and just put a piano plugin on top of it and that's it. You can see that the character gets turned into a 3D character and the character itself is mind boggled. Essentially, realistically to do this within a 3D platform, you would have to rotoscope out the character itself. You would have to rig an animated AI character, which is also time consuming to do, and you would have to match the color and the alignment of the character in 3D space. So when you rotate and track the camera, it also tracks the character as well. Usually this would take three days, one shot that now takes just a simple click of the mouse and about 60 or so minutes of rendering time per shot. They have started opening up this to new beta users. So I believe you can actually get access to this right in the description down below. Check the links. But before you click the link, like click the big subscribe button and click it hard. This is AI Steve Jobs meeting AI Elon Musk. None of this conversation is scripted or pre-programmed. Well, hello there, Elon. This is Steve Jobs on Forever Voices. What a pleasure it is to speak with you. As two innovators in the tech industry, I'm sure we have a lot to discuss. What's on your mind today? Hello, Steve. It's an honor to speak with a tech legend like yourself. As an entrepreneur and innovator, I always have a lot on my mind, especially when it comes to technology and its impact on our world. What topics are you interested in discussing today? Okay. Hello, Elon. It's great to connect with you. As an innovator, I am always fascinated by emerging technologies and their potential to revolutionize industries. Maybe we could discuss some of the breakthroughs you and your team at SpaceX and Tesla have made and how these technologies could change the world in the coming years. All right. SpaceX's Starship, for example, is designed to be fully reusable, which will reduce the cost of space travel and allow us to explore more of the cosmos. And our electric vehicles at Tesla not only promote sustainability, but... 
One topic that I'm particularly interested in is the concept of the technological singularity, which refers to the hypothetical point in the future where artificial intelligence surpasses human intelligence and becomes the driving force behind technological progress. What do you think about this idea? And do you have any thoughts on how this could affect the future of technology and humanity? It stops right there. Why? AI Elon Musk is like, we need to regulate. You can now turn any picture into a meme with just your phone. Can AI generate memes? This guy, when you're waiting for that online order to arrive like subtle this, why have a social life when you can have two washing machines? <laughs> All right. Mm hmm. And they said adulting was difficult. Wow, flat screen in nature sure is breathtaking. Finally, the new home tanning collection has arrived. Can't hear the haters with my new headset. Keep trying though. <laughs> Finally found my ex's perfect match. Slam dunk. Prepare for the awkward silence game show. Meme cam. All right. I wonder if those were straight out of the box or if they have like multiple different ones. But for sure, GPT could be funny sometimes. You can now create a chat bot directly on your website using GPT-4 and your data. Look, this is how it looks like. You just put your website, like for example, producthunt.com, right into the website, fetch some links, and here you can get all the links. And now they're just creating the chat bot customizing the UI, so initial messages. Hey, I'm Product Hunt AI, what can I help you with? Suggested messages, and here you can see what is Product Hunt, how to have a successful launch, things like that. You can even upload a profile picture here, and in a minute, you got the script that you can embed on your website. And just like that, you will have a little pop-up. So this is more simple than you think, it's just literally in the header or body. Here you go, I'm Product Hunt AI, what can I help you with? So that is actually really cool. I'd love to have this for my website as well. This guy created Jarvis with GPT-4 and Siri. And if you wanna watch that, click on this video and that's it. Subscribe and I'll see you over there. Peace.